Guys, we have got something extremely, extremely exciting to kind of unbox and talk to you guys about on today's video. Before I do so, just make sure you drop a like, comment, and subscribe because this one definitely gonna be kind of exciting. Might even be a little bit emotional for me. But right here, guys, basically what I've got is, it's a screenshot of the very first money I ever made selling a product slash service that I actually genuinely made myself. This is the first ever piece of money I ever made in this online space, if you will. So screenshot of that is basically just a Stripe Stripe payment that I'm actually gonna be showing you. I probably might have to block out the name and the customer details on this. Hopefully they should know. It's called William, by the way. I won't say his second name, but if you still watch my YouTube channel, honestly, bro, you was the first ever person to ever believe in me, trust in me, invest in me as well. So I guess what we'll do real quick then is, I don't really have a script for this. I'm just kind of going off the top of my head, if you will. I just wanna keep this one super natural, super authentic. If I get emotional in this, just forgive me by the way, I do feel like I'm tearing up a little bit already. But basically what I've done here guys again is, as you can see it's kind of like unboxing it. Just pulled off this thing right here. Here's the actual frame itself. I'm gonna have this hung up on my wall obviously. In this office somewhere, I don't really know where I'm gonna put it. Probably maybe there on that particular wall there so I can kind of just look over and see it. Every single time I just want a little bit of a motivation if you will. I guess the thought process behind kind of like getting this guys is I just want to make sure that I remind myself of how everything kind of like panned out for my business. So yeah, this is actually a transaction here. I don't know if I'll be able to show you this, but it's basically just the frame, right? Of the actual transaction of the payment itself. I'll throw the payment up there on a screenshot because obviously that way I'll be able to block off everything. But as you can see, it says that it's a payment that I received in my Stripe account on the 15th of January, 2019, 15th or 16th of January. And, and that was for actual a, a coaching call. So you know what's actually really weird, guys? This is just testament to every time I say something on this channel, I can literally back it up with fact. You know how like I said to you guys that I started my YouTube channel, right? And I literally denied helping people. I'm not even joking. Even though I wasn't successful and I was literally stating I wasn't successful, I literally started my, in fact, this is how transparent I've always been on my channel. I literally told you guys I was absolutely broke when starting this business off. I literally told you guys how I was, I believe it was 231 pounds in debt or something like that. It turns out that it was like 230 pounds in debt, not 31 pounds or whatever it was. And the funny thing is, I've always been transparent with you guys on this particular channel. And even, even though I wasn't successful, people were still coming to me for help with their agencies. Even I, I was struggling to build my own agency. To be fair though, I guess the reason why people still wanted to invest in me was because I obviously was serious about the business model. You could obviously see me putting in the work. You could obviously see me starting to at least starting to set, you know, actual sales calls, if you will. And honestly, I was basically just one step ahead of many people that were watching. Some people obviously were way ahead of me, but the people that I was one step ahead of, they actually came forward to me, if you will. And they actually wanted my one-to-one -one help and whatnot. Just help and just wanted to talk or just have a little bit of a conversation with me. I did have a good system for lead sourcing, basically. So this payment right here is a 50 pound payment, right? From a dude that basically paid me to help him install a system into his business so he could pull in leads at scale. So here's how this basically came about real quick. So long story short, I was obviously starting my YouTube channel and I really did not want to do this whole coaching thing or anything like that, to be honest with you. I literally did not. And this is testament. Check out the numbers here, guys. I started my YouTube channel. The first ever video I ever dropped on my YouTube was the 15th. Listen to how crazy this is as well. It's I dropped my first ever YouTube video on the 15th of January, 2018. I actually just did my um, anniversary video uh, early this year. I think it's like, what's that? Four, four, four years or whatever it was on, on my actual YouTube. So it was an entire year later on the exact same day as well. 15th of January, 2019. How cool is that? I actually made my first ever 50 pound payment for a one hour call with somebody. Which obviously at the time, I was like still super broke, still super struggling, still trying to help people, still trying to figure out all this business model and stuff like that. And he actually stepped forward and actually DM me on Instagram. I literally, every single person before him, there was literally hundreds of people coming to me, asking me, Montel, can you help me with this thing? Or can you help me with that thing? And you know what I said to them? I'm not qualified, go and ask somebody else. I'm not doing coaching for an entire year. I am not even joking. I literally put myself off making money myself because I didn't feel successful enough to actually help other people, even though I technically was still one step ahead of most people. Because if you're brand new to SMA and you have no idea what to even do, 
at least I had some sort of way to set meetings at that particular point. I was terrible at closing. I didn't really have any sort of like sales script or, or methodology. And I never saw any, anything before in my entire life. So I was still struggling with that aspect. And it was a personal brand that kind of like came through and got me my first ever 50 pound payment for a lead sourcing strategy. Now, I'm a big believer in not teaching things you've not done yourself. So if you haven't done it yourself, I don't think you should be, well, you probably could teach it, the theory behind it. But me personally, back then, it's just because I probably was scared. I just wanted to be super transparent with people. So I literally turned people away constantly, like over and over and over and over again. And these were people that were literally saying, I will pay you right now to get on a call with you and learn this system from you. And I would literally tell them, I am not successful enough. I don't want to do that. I just want to build my agency and be out basically. So I basically kind of shot myself in, in the own foot, if you will. And this literally denied myself money. I could have easily be making money from my personal brand the, the very first like couple of months, to be honest with you. But this right here, guys, is testament. Just to show you that when I say something, I have receipts to back this shit up. Quite literal, printed out frigging receipts. This looks so beautiful, guys, by the way. I got it from like a company app. I kind of like just cover up this sort of, oh, we can actually do that. So there we go, this is what it kind of looks like if you want. So hopefully that's kind of like covered up. You can kind of see a Stripe transaction, just a screenshot of exactly what you saw on the screen there. Basically, it's just a transaction of 50 pounds, which is quite decent for, for a dude at home. Cause I literally only, all, the only thing I did was with this particular client here, it just literally consulted him with for an hour on Zoom, like literally a 50 pounds for an hour. That's kind of like unheard of. Most people are like going to university and coming out with jobs that are paying them like maybe 18 pound an hour, 20 pound an hour or something like that. I literally just got a student come to me or a client come to me, whatever you want to call them. Consulting client kind of sounds like a much better way to, to name it. But literally got a dude come to me, literally asking me for, for help with his business, put a system in place. And by the way, I was extremely, extremely nervous. I did not feel ready. I felt like I was doing something in, unethical. And the funny thing is, I actually went on to help his business extremely, extremely well. He was actually, he literally, I'm not even joking. The dude literally said to me, it was the best 50 pounds he's ever spent on anything. The best 50 pounds he's ever spent. It's weird how we as humans hold ourselves back because we haven't done something before. And I'm telling you, if you've got that feeling, you just have to get over it and just do it. And here's what I mean by that. That's almost like complaining, right? You're scared to ride a bike because you've never rode a bike before in your life. Of course, it's going to be scary. Of course, you're going to feel like you're doing something wrong. Of course, you're going to fail and fall over and stuff like that. But that's what it's all about. You have to go out there and actually do stuff, if you will. You have to go out there, you actually have to do stuff, you have to try stuff, and you actually have to just go and get experience, if you will. That's what I could probably say to that now. The reason why I've got this printed out again, it's just, I just want this as a constant reminder that there is you know, just abundance of money out there. You can literally go and sell information online or sell services online, sell consulting online, SMA online. It works, basically. It, this is validation. This is like proof of concept that it literally does work. If you've got an actual skill and a service and you actually become valuable, you the more you learn, the more you earn, it literally validates that entire point. So all the books I read, all the training I went through, all the trials and tribulations, all the failures, all the struggling, all of, all of that, it shows me that it's worth it. Now, the funny thing is as well, guys, is the actual frame itself, the actual, to get this made, if you will, I got it from a company called E-Frames or something like that. Delivery was extremely quick. I'm not affiliated or anything like that. Funny, because the actual frame itself costs like 10 pound more than what I made. I think this costs like 60 pounds, and I only made 50 pounds from this call, so it actually cost me more to print this than what I actually made on the actual call, but still, making 50 pound in, in a single hour just from consulting somebody is absolutely amazing in my eyes, like literally. And again, this is literally the first piece of money I ever made online selling something that I actually made and came up with. So I literally developed an entire system of lead sourcing extremely quickly. And here's how I kind of came across this so you guys can kind of replicate this. I literally was in the market of SMA, right? And I noticed that most gurus out there, if you will, when they teach SMA, and it's even still prevalent to this day, by the way, I've noticed that most of them, when they teach SMA, they kind of skip over how to get leads at scale, how to get leads that are quality at scale, and then actually do the outreach at scale. So I actually had a good system for that, and I still do, by the way. That's kind of like how I got my forte. That's quite literally Montel strength, if you will. And I was talking about how this is kind of like prevalent in the industry, and people are like, yo, this dude's actually onto something because when I try to build my agency and do outreach, before I can even do outreach, first of all, it's taking me a long time. Second of all, I don't even have enough businesses to reach out to because I can't f collect them fast enough to even get the numbers out that I need to be hitting every single day. So if you need to be hitting like 100 outreach per day, for example, and you don't even have 100 leads to reach out to, how on earth are you gonna do 100 outreach per day? 
That's what I'm trying to say. So I actually figured out a really, really good lease sourcing, prospecting, scraping kind of like system. By the way, I've still to this day never seen anybody in their programs come up with a full comprehensive system like how I've got. Even to this day, I am not even joking, guys. The way how I use certain software systems, processes, and then put them all together to what basically happens is you end up with quality leads, like thousands of them within a couple of clicks, just through using a couple of software. It's quite extremely impressive. So this dude paid me 50 pounds for that. He went on to obviously build out, I think he actually built out quite a successful agency, to be honest with you. But that wasn't actually my point. I wasn't trying to help him build a successful agency because I, again, I didn't even have a successful agency myself. I was just helping him with a very with, with one sliver of what it takes to run an overall agency. Because obviously there's lead sourcing, there's prospecting, there's outreach, there's sales, there's service delivery, there's the overall management of the entire business. All the things I, didn't, I wasn't really good at. But when it came to just lead sourcing and prospecting, I was obviously good at that. Good enough for somebody to come forward and say, you know what, Montel, I've heard what you said on the YouTube channel. I feel like you can actually help my actual agency. I just basically just said, oh, you know what, once and for all, it's been a year now. Um, not made a single piece of money. By the way, even this YouTube channel, it's still not monetized. I have literally never, ever, ever, ever made a penny from making these free videos, except from people that come forward from me and they can see who I am and they, they can see the transparency and they actually want to work with me. That's the only time I ever make money from YouTube and whatnot. And I don't really push this. It's not like I'm out there running ads. It's not like I'm out there doing outreach to people to try sell my online courses or consulting. If you know me, you know me, basically. And if you want my help and you see that it genuinely can help you, that's when you either get on a call with me or you go below, click the links, whatever it is you wanna do. Yeah, guys, honestly, absolutely insane. I kinda of forgot what I was basically saying there, but this right here, my guys, is literally validation that anybody can do this. And it's validation that you don't need to be an expert and know everything in order to make money online. I need you guys to understand this. You do not need to be an expert or know everything in order for you to make money online. This, by the way, this payment right here is validation of that. If I can do it, you can do it. I literally never sold anything before this, except for doing dropshipping. I feel like dropshipping doesn't count, by the way. I did actually have a quite quite a few successful days and quite, quite decent months with dropshipping before this. And I transitioned into SMA, couldn't really get it to work for ages. But then straight away, like like what most people, as soon as they kind of like saw me on YouTube channel, YouTube and stuff like that, I just kept it super real and down to earth with people. I was telling people that it's harder than what you think. The lead sourcing stuff is genuinely difficult, but I feel like I've got a good system for this, blah, 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 blah. And I wasn't even trying to push that as like selling that. This is validation that the market is always right. And it rewards people that have actual good systems, if you will. As in like, I didn't think to start selling coaching to people at all. This was literal people coming to me saying that they want this sort of, basically what I did was, is I give Susie what Susie wanted for lunch. As in Susie, this person, I'm just gonna pretend to call Susie just for the analogy that I like to use on this YouTube channel and, for, and to my other like consulting clients and stuff like that. But the market is always right. The market will always tell you what it actually wants. If it wants Facebook ads, it will, it will tell you it wants Facebook ads by the certain problems that they're having. So you actually have to tune your ears in order to listen to other people's problems and then offer a solution for that. And this person right here came to me with a problem and I was like, you know what, dude? I genuinely think I can help you with that. Went on to help, even though I was super nervous. He actually, by the way, he DM'd me. I did not reach out to this person. I didn't even know they existed. It's weird, really weird, but they actually came forward to me from my Instagram and whatnot, DM'd me and, we, and I said, you know what? I think I can actually genuinely help you with this. I didn't even know how to price this, by the way. I just found for, for, for the hour. It was completely fine with that. Tried it over straight away. Literally didn't even bat an eye to it, to be honest with you, because obviously it's super cheap. Set up a system for him, and I guarantee you, if he uses that system right now, he could easily go and build a 10k per month agency. If he's already got, assuming that is, he's already got the other stuff in, in place, such as like he's got an actual sales process, he's got an actual good service delivery um, kind of like model. I literally showed him a way to pull in literally thousands of leads really, really quickly that you can reach out to and deploy outreach to really, really quickly in order to set up calls. So I know for a fact this was ROI positive. I mean, it's, it's hard not to be ROI positive, it's only 50 pounds. And I'm showing you an actual, in fact, just from the time I saved him, let's say you're working minimum wage and it takes you a couple of hours to pull in leads, you know, and obviously you have to do lead sourcing every single day. So if you actually factor in the maths behind this, like how much you make at minimum wage, I don't know, eight to $10 or whatever it is, $12, $15, whatever it is, times that by how many hours it would have taken him to get the same amount of leads I was able to get him. The ROI is clear cut. There's no doubt about it. Just from the time saved alone, never mind the potential and the opportunities that's going to give him when he actually starts doing the, the outreach and stuff like that. But yeah, guys, super, super proud with this, man. It's absolutely beautiful. The frame is actually aluminum, as you guys say over in America. It's aluminum, by the way. <laughs> no, we're, not, we're not having an argument on this channel. But anyway, long story short, guys, this is a metal frame, if you want. I'm going to definitely hang this on my wall. Absolutely amazing. 
Mwah. Yeah, absolutely love you guys. Honestly guys, I just want to say thank you to everybody that's obviously invested in me and just watched the YouTube channel. I'm not trying to get emotional right now, but this right here is validation. My first ever piece of money I've ever made from a product that's actually mine. And what I mean by that is, I physically came up with the systems, the processes, the tools, put them all together and actually had a working system that literally would work for agency owners because I was doing it myself. So I solved the problem for myself first. I didn't even really go out there and offer it to people. People just came to me and I was like, okay, maybe I can help this person. You know what? I'm just going to try it. I'm just going to see what happens if I try it. Tried it. I was super nervous. Turns out that the dude literally said it. It was literally the, I'm not even, this, I quote, it was the best 50 pounds I ever spent, ever. I'm not sure what this is in US dollars, maybe like 60, 70 dollars or something like that for the hour. So that's obviously quite good. I just made that from home on one single sales call for an hour, which is obviously really, really cool. I guess what you can take from this video is this. Go and learn a skill, get good at the skill and solve a problem for yourself first and then go and sell that skill. Talk about it, why it's a problem in the market and people will actually step forward and come to you. If you actually got market validation like this, people will come to you and actually pay you for your help. If you but honestly guys, absolutely nuts. Definitely getting that, hung, that frame hung up on my wall somewhere. Yeah guys, hope you've enjoyed this video. I didn't really know where I was going with this and hopefully I don't look too emotionally distressed but I do feel a little bit emotional to be honest with you. Probably go cry in the bathroom in a bit. Uh, just keeping a safe, a strong face for you guys. But yeah, honestly, guys, come a long, long way since then. That was 15th of January, 2019, guys. Literally, it's, it's Monday, the 16th of May, 2022 right now. So yeah, absolutely insane, guys. Uh, but again, another testament. When I literally said, I'm pretty sure you may, you, if you've been using this, if you've been following me on YouTube, you will literally hear me say that I literally denied people for an entire year because I didn't want to make money from the YouTube instead of doing the thing that I said I was trying to do, which is SMA and stuff like that. Um, so I literally denied people and it got to a point where I was like, you know what, people are literally stepping forward. Why am I denying money and struggling and not eating? I genuinely think I can help somebody, therefore I should do that. And the funny thing is, now that I'm actually a more mature grown entrepreneur, that's what business is supposed to be like anyway. You have something that helps people, they, people pay you for it and you actually genuinely help them for it or, or with that said thing if you want. That's just normal business one on one. Nothing shady, nothing scammy about that. No MLM, no MM, no, no guru -y tactics, no sales tricks, no nothing. No gimmicks, is what I'm trying to say. Just straight authenticity, attracting people. Your vibe attracts your tribe, as they say. So, long story short, guys, hope you've enjoyed this. Hope you can take something from this. Honestly, guys, just want to say thank you to all of you guys. Really do appreciate each and every single one of you. Don't forget to drop a like, comment, and subscribe. And if you do eventually want to work with me, Link is below. I do. I still do like one-on-one -on -one stuff with people, and I still have you know age tramitation if you want to enroll in that. So we do have some really good, really good systems for you as well, um, evidently. But long story short, guys, hope you're doing well. Again, like I said, see you guys in the next video. Like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys soon. Peace.